Hi guys! Welcome to another mini Archie tour. Tara, pasok tayo! Ni hao! Welcome back to another episode of my vlog. So, good morning, Edsa. Good morning, traffic. Ayan, yan ang peg natin for today. Dahil papunta tayo sa site. We're in doon siya sa Ortigas. Actually, nandito na ako. Kanina sobrang traffic talaga. And, ayun, nandito ako sa likod ng Mega Mall ba to? Ayan. So, pupunta muna ako sa Robinson's Galleria to buy something for the site. And, mag-aayos din ako doon. Ayan, para ma-prepare ko yung vlog for today. Ayan. So, I'll be showing you yung ating newly turnover na 3-bedroom condo unit. And, ayun, makikita nyo ako anong um, before and after niya. Magbibigay ako ng konting snippets. Ayan. So, ayun lang. I'll see you later. Ayan. So, malapit na ako sa site. And, ito yung Ortigas Avenue. And, malapit na ako. Doon na lang siya. So, medyo traffic lang. Ng konti. And, ayan na. Dito na ako. So, ayan. Nandito ko ngayon sa Corinthian Executive Region City dito sa Pasig. And, ayan siya. Ayan, mataas yung unit na to, 39 floors. And later on, I'll be showing you yung natapos na aming project. Hi guys! So, nandito ako ngayon sa may... Nakalimutan ko anong street to. Basta, nearby lang sa Robinson's Galleria. Ayan lang yung Robinson's. Ayan lang siya. So, walking distance lang, going to this condo. And, um, bumili kasi ako ng aircon. And gusto ko lang din ihabol actually dito sa vlog ko for today. Hello! Ayan. So, nakakahiya. Merong, ano, mobile car na nag-high sa atin. Ayan. So, anyway, um, nawala tuloy ako. Nahiya ako dun sa mga police. Ayan. Masa, anyway, um, dun yung, andito lang yung condo unit. Dito sa my, I forgot the street name. So, ayan. Um, akit na rin ako. And, gusto ko lang din ipakita sa inyo na super lapit niya talaga. Yung uh, Mega Mall is nearby din. Hi guys! Tara, pasok tayo. So, this house is actually a condo unit which is located here in Pasig. This house is in the penthouse level. So, this unit has three bedrooms and a small bedroom then for the driver. And also, meron din siyang two toilet and bath. Yan. So, ang condo unit's Mostly well-known yan into providing a compact space lang. So, very important that you design the space properly and take into consideration that all of the um, angles or all of the sulok ng bahay is functional. So, as you can see, from my background, ang prominent colors are the neutral colors and of course, yung ating pastel pink. Yan. So, before tayo mag-head on dun sa ating iba pang mga areas. I want to flex muna itong ginawa namin, yung dinesign namin na um, French na mirror and also yung ating cabinet here in the entrance. So, syempre ang inisip natin, pagpasok natin ng bahay, gusto natin malinis lagi. So, we made sure na meron tayong uh, shoe cabinet here. Ayan, tapos there's another storage here. Pwede itong mga shelves, pwede yung bag mo, yung keys and all. Ayan, tapos here on top, meron pa rin siyang cabinet. So, ito naman ang nilalagay natin dito. Pwedeng ilagay or of course, ito yung mga eco bag. So, before ka mag-grocery, you grab one and then go. 
And meron din tayo, of course, built-in na uh, bench with our cushion para ito yung backrest natin. Para when you sit down and then you eat, yan, pagkakain ka, it's very comfy. Yan. Tapos as you can see, ang ganda ng space natin here, yung ating seating space. Kasi ako, personally, pag kumakain, pwedeng gumanyan. Half Indian seat. Hindi ko alam kung tama yung term ko. Pero ganyan. Tapos, of course, itong ating bench. Meron din yang Tada! Storage space. This living area is more of yung mga built-ins natin. So, I'm sitting here, dito sa ating bench. Uh, meron tayong sofa set here. Medyo mahirap lang talagang pumili ng right furnitures when it comes to condos. Kasi, sa mga furnitures, usually, sa sofa, very wide, very deep. Yan. So, since limited yung ating space, we have to consider all of the angles talaga. And all of the measurements. And, since meron tayong uh, bench here, nag-provide din tayo, of course, ng cushion, ng backrest. Kasi syempre, pag meron silang bisita, very comfy yung pag-upo nila dito. And since built-in nga siya, meron din tayong mga cabinets here. After kung ipakita sa inyo yung ating bench, I'm going to show you naman yung ating TV accent wall. So, ito yung kanilang... Uh, newly bought na 55 inches na TV which is hanged dun sa ating accent wall. So, this is of PVC. And so, ito yung ating accent. And then, kinombine natin siya with the fluted panels. And, naglagay din tayo ng TV console here. So, one of the tips that I would want to share with you is that when you have a small space, mas maganda sana if the built-ins are also um, thought well thought of. So, kung makikita mo yung aming TV console, naka-float siya. It has a shadow gap wherein ma ma feel mo na mas malaki yung space mo. Not only that, dun sa ating bench, if you can see, meron din kasi tong shadow gap. So, meron siyang feeling na meron pa siyang clearance underneath. And doon din sa ating bench, doon sa dining area, ganun din. Meron din tayong shadow gap. So, it creates an illusion na mas malaki yung space. Ayan. So, nandito naman tayo sa kanilang dining area. So, for the dining area, we chose na mag-provide ng dining set na gray color. Kasi nga, ang shabby chic is more of the mixture, right mixture of neutrals and the pastels. Etong kanilang dining set is actually, pwede siyang i-extend. This is the extended version na. Since ang client ko kasi is very more of the kikai, kikai side, and dun sa initial part ng aming designing stage, na-specify niya kasi kagad na she wanted all of her um, kitchen appliances to be of smeg. Thus, etong mga appliances niya. And smeg is actually well known then with um, striking na mga colors. There's pastel and then meron din na orange and may black din sila, may cream. And we think na suited talaga kay client yung color pink. Why? Very thoughtful siya, very charming, and yun ang color na mostly associated with her traits, which is yung color pink. Last time, etong unit nila, sobrang dark. Kasi ang color na meron dito before is red and black. So, super duper dark siya. And then the, the lights, sobrang minimal yung lights niya. Kaya now, nagulat si client na naging very bright yung kanyang space. Yan. So, nandito naman tayo sa ating kitchen space. So, for the kitchen, as you can see, very clean looking lang siya. Clean, sleek, and minimalistic. Yan. So, we do have, of course, our under, under cabinet lighting. Here in the condo, bawal yung non-synthetic na countertop. So, 
we are only allowed to use solid surface. Kaya we chose yung white para very clean lang yung kanyang kitchen. And then our backsplash also is of neutral color. Yan. Tapos, um, since we do have some black elements, like the French um, mirror, we have provided then yung kanyang faucet to be of black. So this is the border that we have created wherein this would separate the kitchen from the hallway where I'm standing from. Yan. So ito, actually, this wraps around from the side to the top and to the other side. So in a way, it creates a space wherein it's separated from the dining and the living space. But with the design, kasi, if you can see the colors, it matches the benches, it matches yung ating countertop. Yan. So everything is holistically designed. Even our wall color is of light gray, which is also the same as our backsplash. As you can see, yung backsplash natin, it's not of plain uh, color lang. It has grains yan so me texture yung dating ng ating backsplash tapos here natupad natin ang wish ng ating client wherein everything is from smeg so ito yung ating smeg na range hood and yung kanyang induction cooker so punta na tayo sa pinaka nakaka-excite na part during the delivery is yung ating fridge yan so to be honest, this is the first time that I have opened yung smeg na fridge kasi wala. Parang feeling ko ang mahal niya. Pero ang ganda pala niya talaga. Yan. So the color really suits her. So let's go to the common toilet. Ayan. So this is a good size toilet wherein it has its own shower, the toilet bowl, and yung ating um, lavatory with the, of course, yung ating cabinets for storage ng ating mga toiletry stuff. Yan. So, last time, it used to have a, um, what do you call this? A glass enclosure. And actually, in advice ko rin si client na tanggalin na lang to make the space more um, cozy then and more spacious. Kasi, ang glass enclosure, it's a divider. So, since it's a compact space, yun, much, much better na wala na lang siya. So, punta muna tayo sa bedroom number one. Welcome to the bedroom number one. So, this bedroom has a double deck. Ayan, as you can see. And yung ating bed, she bed sheets are of pink color pa rin to match yung ating outside. So, dito naman tayo sa ating French door which is actually a window itself. This is customized also na ma-open siya and to have a breathe of air. I can't say fresh since, since we are in Ortiga CBD. So, hindi ko masabing fresh. Yan. So, yan siya. And you can go outside and also safe siya kasi meron siyang double lock. And you can go outside of the balcony. And dito naman sa katabi ng ating door is our vanity table. So yung ating vanity table is also built in. Yan. So as you can see, yung ating chair, very comfy siyang makakapasok dyan. And underneath ng ating chair, ah, ng ating table is, of course, another cabinet. So, sabi ko nga sa inyo, since you are living in a condo and everything is compact, you have to make sure na very functional lahat ng areas. So, this table serves, at, serves as your vanity table and also it can be your working table or your study table. We have provided yung kanilang um, outlet for their laptops, for their blowers, for their hair curlers or whatnot. And then, a good size mirror. Yan. So, as you can see, yung lining niya is gold. And then, it's beside 
the French door, which is old and rustic. Yan. And a combination of the new ones, diba? So, perfect shabby chic. So, let's go to the master bedroom. Ayan. Welcome to the new master bedroom. So, this is a queen-size bed. In front of the bed is her sliding na wardrobe, which is also built in, of course. Ayan siya. So, here... There's an ample space for hanging the clothes. And also, meron tayong drawers here. Ayan. For extra storage space of your clothes. Ayan. Actually, pwede magtago dito yung bata eh. Ayan. Isa sa mga laruan to eh. And we also have yung ating shelves here to put more stuff like yung mga bed sheets and all. Ayan. So, of course, it's an easy glide. Ayan. Glide, is a slide mo lang siya and it's close. And also, kung makikita nyo yung ating design, again, it ties up with the design from the living, dining, kitchen, and the bedrooms. So, in the headboard area, we do have our design also, which is yung ating fluted panels and combined with white. Yan, para umangat yung ating fluted panel plus yung pinaka-headboard ng ating bed. So, earlier, sabi ko sa inyo, ang aking client is very kikay. So, what's her room without her vanity table? So, meron tayong vanity table here with matching light, lighted na LED mirror. Yan, so, whatever mood she is in. Siyempre, sa master bedroom, you have your own toilet and bath. So, this is where the sliding door is. So, this is the master bedroom toilet and bath. This area is a tad bit bigger than the one in the common area. So, ito yung kanyang shower space. Very good size and it's very spacious. So, as you can see, meron tayong black elements. Yeah, to tie up with our design. And meron din tayo here na built-in um, overhead vanity cabinet. And meron tayong customized na mirror. Yan, kinustomize namin, na, natin siya for the full height and yung full length niya. Yan. And inside, I want to show you, nag-customize din tayo. Since this is a window, kinustomize din natin na magkaroon ng louver type na uh, window here. And of course, meron siyang screen. Meron din tayong lavatory cabinet here with the storage here. Pero meron personal stuff na dito si client so I don't want to open it na. Tapos na tayo sa master bedroom, sa common bedroom. Let's go now to the bonus room. Kasi as you can see, across this hallway, you're going to see a bedroom door here, which is actually a bonus bedroom. Yan, punta na tayo dito so I can show you what it looks like. So here, we have a guest room and we do have a huge uh, wardrobe, which is also a sliding wardrobe. And... Uh, single bed na a single bed so this bed is i think this is 10 inches thick na mattress so good size and good space for sleeping and of course we have provided yung ating guests ng vanity table din yan so wala pa lang siyang chair pero it's the same you have a drawer here and yung iyong Mirror. Ang sabi ko ba, isa lang yung bonus na bedroom. Mali pala ako. I have one more bonus room, but this one is for the driver. So, this louver door is for the driver. Hindi ko na lang siya i-open pala. Yan. So, this one you can see, maganda yung kanyang wall art. It's more of the muted pink, which ties up with our uh, pastel color. Yan guys, finally natapos na tayo. And I hope na nakatulong sa inyo itong vlog na to. And gusto ko lang share ng very very quick na sobrang na-excite ako dito sa project na to. 
dahil very passionate yung aking client with the designs, with the furnitures and all. And gusto talaga niya madress up. Imagine, sinama niya ako to buy her furnitures, her appliances, especially tong mga smeg. So, I had the ex a great experience with buying and purchasing stuff with her. Ayan. So, thank you, client, for choosing us to transform your home. Ayan. So, ayun lang pa. Gabi na. I have to go na rin. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye!